Mario Brothers. This ain't no game. As someone who has been a Mario fan since childhood, I was obviously wary when Illumination was announced to be working on a movie for our favourite plumber, and the casting of Chris Pratt as Mario himself always felt like a weird choice to me. Thankfully, I am very happy to report that this Mario movie is a great time, boasting Illumination's most gorgeous animation to date, alongside the charm of the franchise. The various characters are all well realised, with great performances from everyone. Even Chris Pratt, to my pleasant surprise, makes for a decent Mario, and his chemistry with Charlie Day's Luigi is believably wholesome. Of course, we all knew that Jack Black was going to kill it as Bowser, but I wasn't prepared for what we got. Illumination somehow managed to strike a perfect balance between Bowser's more goofier side, while also depicting him at his most villainous, making for a very engaging villain. Seth Rogen entertains as Donkey Kong, and Anya Taylor-Joy gets to play a Princess Peach who fills the mental role instead of the traditional damsel in distress. Toad isn't annoying either. The action set pieces are fun, and Illumination deserves some kudos for not spoiling everything in the trailers for once. Look at you, Sing 2. As well as also keeping it looking like the Mario art style, instead of their own. Well, for the most part. There is that one dog who looks like he came right out of the secret life of pets. Honestly, I don't really have much to criticise here outside of nitpicks like the dog thing. I know some people have been iffy on the pacing, but if your main issue is that it's too short, then that just means you're enjoying the experience so much already. In short, this is a great Mario movie that will hopefully please both longtime fans and newcomers stepping into the Mushroom Kingdom for the first time. Well, that was the Super Mario Bros. movie, and this has been Overly Positive Reviews. See you folks, and remember, it can be a harsh world out there, so let's try and make things a bit more positive, shall we?